hello and welcome everyone so in this video let's do some minimum and maximum function on a certain array so here I'm just putting in the bundle array with some values integer values and we're going to get those uh, the minimum and the maximum of this array so the next step is just I'm just getting the size of the array uh, to know the length of the array so that we can iterate on them so to get the minimum I'm, I'm just going to uh, set in a function named min which uh, uh, will be getting the uh, address of the array and also its size okay same is true with the maximum value okay and then I'm just going just to print it out afterwards the result in the screen so I'm just copying this uh, line here and making uh, another print line printf in which it will be printed the maximum value or the yeah the minimum value okay after making this uh, function main we, we were going to proceed about making the prototype of the functions that was uh, created in 16 and line 16 and 17 so the first one is min which will be getting the address of the and also the size just need to uh, write up the prototype here and then <clears throat> we proceed with the, doing the body of the function below the function main so we first need to write in the function minimum or min so again uh, it takes in the the input va parameters as the address of the array and the size and then just I'm um, just making some integer here called result in which it is going to get the first value of the array okay that is where we store the data next in this for loop it will just test if the uh, existing element will be as minimum uh, smaller than the result if it's smaller then the result value of the result will be changed to that of the elements value okay afterwards we just need to return the result so we just need to copy this uh, function and just modify uh, the for loop to put in here as a test for greater than rather than less than and then that's it okay next we just need to save this uh, program now let's just uh, compile them compile the software and then let's execute it so now the result is maximum 97 and minimum negative 2 and if you can see on the array that's about it it's the same so thank you for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this video See you in my next video. Okay. Bye.